Brought to you by GTA, your island, your network. Camouflage, heavy artillery, and plumes of green smoke could be seen as Marines tactically engaged buildings in northern Guam as part of Exercise Team Sword. And it's a bilateral exercise with the uh, Japanese Self-Defense Force and the United States Marine Corps and some other uh, uh, branches of the military as well. Captain Jeremy Oberdove said the joint exercise aims to increase combat readiness and effectively respond to threats against Japan or to crises in the region. Today's training simulated an amphibious landing that can be used for both humanitarian and combat missions. Oberdove said the training allows Marines to gain experience in jungle conditions. He added the maneuvers conducted here in Guam will help shape the operations for additional training in Tinian. One of the hundreds of Marines participating in the exercise is Lance Corporal Jordan Damien Perez, a Chamorro from Tacoma, Washington, who will be seeing his family here in Guam for the very first time. It's honestly like a blessing because it's always something we wanted to do. It's just something we weren't able to really afford. So kind of getting to know your culture and being able to have that opportunity is a, it's a big deal to me. Exercise Keen Sword is ongoing and residents should expect to see Marines throughout the island for the remainder of this week. Reporting for Guam's News Network, I'm Lisa Baza. Brought to you by GTA, your island, your network.